Okay, what is happening, Cucumber Squad, and welcome back to the Fable Sphere. On to the next Skip the Line reaction. Thank you so much, Tika. I appreciate the request. I know we've got two for you. Your next one's coming after this. Um, this one is Su Hyang. We haven't done Su Hyang for so what for so long, and she's an absolute, um, absolutely amazing female vocalist. Uh, this one is Sweet Dreams, My Dear, Lost Ark official soundtrack. I'm not sure what Lost Ark is, um, and hopefully this doesn't get blocked. But we've put all the copyright things for the video it's usually the video that makes that gets it blocked so we, 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 we keep our fingers crossed right so Su Hyang uh, Tika thank you very much I really appreciate the skip the line request let's rock and roll Promises warmth tomorrow, just like a dusky sunset in splendor. I remember the humming sound is passing by, the tears we have held back, all the dreams that. song i don't know lost arc i'm not does this is this a game or is this a um anime series of some sort i don't i don't watch anime and i don't play um, um much uh, video games either um but it looks like it's a game of some sort very theatrical type song um which is you know it's, it's very much like a broadway type song I, I, I'd, I'd see this type of song in a broadway musical uh to a certain degree it's okay so far, if I, I must be honest. Her voice is obviously, it's Su Hyang, Su Hyang. she's absolutely amazing. I think her, her vocals are incredible. I've seen a lot of really nice pieces by her. So far, it's okay. very positive lyrics i like the instrumentation on it as well um uh, it, it's a nice it's all in all like i said it's a theatrical song that you would listen to on in like broadway in a broadway type musical or in something like this obviously like a soundtrack of uh, um either a game or um uh, a, i don't know what, what would you call this a series of some sort <laughs> place I used to stay waiting for you to call me life sometimes becomes a shining starlight gazing at you make my heart more very powerful song it's, it's really it really is nice it just this this kind of like um theatrical um you know type piece 
Um, it's got its place. But it's not the kind of piece that I put on my playlist and say, okay, I'm going to listen to this again and again and again. I find it, I actually find it a little too overwhelming for me. You know, the instruments that really works for certain things for like, you know, soundtrack of this or it works for, you know, a, like, I, like I said before, like a stage performance or musical and things like that. But as a everyday listening song, I find this gets very like very sonically irritating to a certain degree i'm not saying it's an irritating song it's just it reminds me a lot of like frozen you know what i mean it's got like that kind of vibe and i just it's one of those things that i can't even listen to um me personally like putting it in the background it's like i can't even listen to um um something like this in um in the maybe if it's just playing in the background fine but it, it really does have a very specific definite place for me um and, and that place wouldn't be on my playlist uh, you know sadly but that's just me I, i'm not to say that it's not a great song i've got other songs by su hyun that are absolutely incredible that are on my playlist just this particular one is just whenever they do it i mean who was the other artist um uh, morissette mon she also does some of those theatrical ones and i give her the same thing it's just i say cool you deliver on it really well does such a great job of it. I mean, Su Hyang would obviously do a great job of it. So would you know, um, you know, Morissette. But um, it's just, it's it's not, it's not my vibe or my everyday listening. It's got its place again. Uh, not to sound too repetitive, but it is that's what I, that's how I feel. <laughs> I mean, you can't really say it's a bad song. You can't say it was delivered badly. Delivered beautifully. Su Hyang always delivers really well. Instrumentation was great. Very positive, uplifting, powerful song, right? So in all three aspects, really nice. But just from a sonic, sonical perspective, it's just not something that I would uh, put on my playlist. It's, it's got its, uh, I'm going to say it again. It, you know, it's, it's meant to be be somewhere it has its purpose and it does its purpose really well but on an everyday type listening this kind of song would annoy me um, after like the second listen <laughs> so yeah anyway um i hope that's uh I, you guys just let me know what you think and if you feel the same if you don't feel the same I'm sorry about it that's just how i feel i love you all man please stay safe please stay healthy and i'll catch you on the next one peace